So guys, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about some new information regarding the jetpack. Now some new information has been found, or rather some new files have been found alongside the 1.13 update. And I'm going to be showing you all this information now, and it was all provided by a guy called Chrome X Muds. Now he made a great forum post about this a while back, stating that some new files were found in 1.12. He also showed you guys exactly where to look for this information yourself, just to prove to you guys that it wasn't fake. But the same thing has happened once again, some new files for the jetpack have actually been put into the game alongside the 1.13 update and of course that begs the question why do Rockstar keep adding jetpack files into the game if there is going to be no jetpack in the future. Of course I'm not saying it's 100% confirmed that the jetpack is coming but it does seem odd that they keep adding these files into the game and once again guys before you do say it's fake I'm going to be showing you exactly where you can look for this information yourself. I will have the link to the forum post down in the description below on how you guys can look for that. Also, I'm going to be doing another video later on which is a brand new RP glitch that works for both the Xbox and the PlayStation, so make sure you guys leave a like if you do want to see that, and as soon as we do hit 700 likes, I will get that out to you guys straight away. Anyway, without further ado, let's get straight into this. So I'm going to start this off by taking you guys back to the 1.12 jetpack files. I'm going to be reading a portion of the actual post itself, and it says, Hey guys, so today while looking through and reversing the 1.12 XEX, which is the executable files for GTA 5, I found something very interesting. Now I know a lot of people are going to say it's deprecated and old, but I will stop you there as this actually hasn't appeared until 1.12. I found a string in the XEX called jetpack. It hasn't been there at all until now, and here is proof. And he shows the 1.12 information, as you guys can see, he shows the previous executable files, which says dead, drunk, and parachuting. And then when 1.12 executable files came in with the 1.12 update, it said dead, drunk, jetpack, and then parachuting. So basically, the jetpack file was added into the game alongside the 1.12 update. And once again, the question is, why do Rockstar keep adding jetpack files into the game if they're going to be doing nothing with it in the future? Now, there was a bunch of other files that was added in with the 1.12 update. I actually made a video about that. If you guys want to check that out, there will be a link down in the description below. But there was a bunch of task files for the jetpack and there was a few more files. I'm gonna have a quick screenshot of some of the 1.12 files here on the screen right now. But I'm now going to be moving into the new 1.13 update files that have just been added into the game and once again if you guys want to check this out a link to the forum post will be down in the description below a bunch of other hackers have confirmed that these files are in the game but as you guys can see here are the 1.13 update files and it basically states prop spa jetpack jetpack underscore flight and then jetpack underscore hover so basically there are commands for the jetpack of course jetpack flight and jetpack hover now why are these files or these code in the game if Rockstar is not planning something big with this now people are saying that this could be a troll but then again why would Rockstar add code into the game just to troll people knowing that hackers are going to get in there I mean it just doesn't make any sense and my opinion is that the jetpack is definitely coming I'm going to show you guys a few more screenshots of the code once again here is some of the task movements as you guys can see there it says movement task C task jetpack task tuning and then movement task again and then here is the other close-up screenshot which is the jetpack underscore flight and then the jetpack underscore hover and I want to know what your guys opinion is on this do you guys think the jetpack is coming once again the question to you guys is why is Rockstar adding these files into the game and do you think if the jetpack does arrive it will be single player DLC multiplayer DLC or do you think it may actually come in the form of an easter egg or an interactable easter egg where you do have to do a bunch of steps and tell me what you guys think in the comment section down below and also if you guys want to check these files for yourselves and you do know how to check the executable files for GTA 5 then you can go to this location right here and it will take you over to the jetpack files and also if you do need any help looking for this once again the link to the forum post will be down in the description below that forum post is great it's a great community over there guys they are talking about all these new files confirming it all and it's a great place to actually check out in general so make sure you check it out and without further ado i'm going to leave the comment you there also like i did say at the start guys as soon as we do hit 700 likes on this video i will be getting an rp glitch a brand new one out to you guys today so make sure you leave a like if you do want to see that and without further ado i'm going to leave it there i hope you all did enjoy and with that being said i will see you all in the next video